And time to take a look at what's trending. Fox 61's Margot Farrell is at Winterberry Gardens in Southington with the plants you can buy to make your yard beautiful. April showers bring May flowers and green thumb or not, gardening is in. Since COVID, it seems like uh, that hasn't been, been a really big trend. From flowers to trees and everything in between, Sebi has you covered. Now, let's talk greens. The trend has been towards bigger and bolder uh, veggies. Uh, this is cilantro right here, but we've got a whole host of basils, parsleys, and you name it. And if you're not one for getting your hands dirty, look up. These are one of our favorites. These are called Tumbling Tom tomatoes, and uh, pretty soon these things will be tumbling over with tons of little tomatoes. Some are yellow, some are red. They're very, very sweet and they never get to the house. I was just going to say, you pluck them as you go, right? Now, I've never had a green thumb and for those of you who don't either, succulents may be the plants for you. Succulent gardening was a huge trend all through last year and we're still seeing it everywhere. Good news is you don't have to water these guys too often and you can even get your kiddos involved for creative family activity. So that's obviously a huge trend too, which is getting the kids outdoors and getting them active in things. And this is something that the whole family can do. We saw the end products, but where do we start? The most important thing, in my estimation, is to add compost to your soil. Sebi says you've got to lay the compost to make sure your plants stay healthy. You'll find your plants will be happy, and when your plants are happy, just you're like happy. home life, you're happy. <laughs> now you've got your compost, time to seed. It's important to start with a, a seed tray, and this is what they look like. We start with a, um, a combination of sphagnum moss, pyrolite, which is a little volcanic ash, and vermiculite. And if you do it correctly, <laughs> if you do it correctly, <laughs> this is what you end up with. All right, so hopefully this is what your finished product looks like. But if not, well, you can always try one of the other things we've shown you today. With What's Trending, I'm Margot Farrell. I'll see you back here next Thursday, Fox 61 News.